Right. I want my husband not to be my best friend. I hope we have nothing in common. Really? <laughs> I think it's sometimes. Yeah, yeah, no, I hope we have nothing. In, Why okay. do you say that, Pearl? Why do you yeah, say that? Yeah, because um, I think when women and men are the same, like, I think we Opposites women, we attract. start to we start to yeah, compete yeah, yeah. with the men, and we, like, the, you know, I, I just think that it's better if we're super different and have mm. nothing in common, and we're not best friends. Because you can you go know, off and do your own things, like, like and then... My, my best friends, I want to talk about the Kardashian. I mean, I'm not a big Kardashian, but that's just an example, right? <laughs> I want to talk about stupid girl shit with. Yeah. I don't want to talk about stupid girl shit with Agreed. my husband. I don't want to do that. that to y'all. I get that. And him. And I wouldn't want to hear it. <laughs> and I don't want my husband to talk to me right. the same way he talks to a man. Yeah. I need it softer than that. You know, yeah. I know, I know. I come, well, it's the communic- it's the directness, right? I know right? on this podcast, you know, I can, you know, be, but I might be a bit disagreeable. But in, in real life, I'm actually quite agreeable. I don't need the, <laughs> you ever hear, I used to work at a plumbing tech company, right? I used to sell like shit to plumbers and i went to do like a presentation at one of them and it's like a super male dominated environment i could not believe the way that guy the guys were talking to each other they were so mean they're like roasting mm. the shit out of each other and like it, it, like you know that they say locker room talk you don't want to hear it men like change the way they talk a little bit when we're they're around us like yeah, usually yeah. I, I was like if this is how guys talk to each other i don't want nothing <laughs> no. keep keep talking to me like you talk to a girl God, guys will god when you i think i was just talking about this romeo like guys will Especially if you're a good-looking guy and you're in a group of boys, one thing they'll do is if you have any sort of flaw, whether it's physical, they're gonna point out that flaw because they have to have someone what up on you. If you're a good-looking dude and and you get girls, they have to be all right. You're overweight or, or this or that. Like what? You're, you're friends. You're friends with women. You would never be like, oh, you're, Courtney. I'm not saying you're overweight. I'm just saying like you would never be like Courtney. You're overweight. Like, come on, get your shit. Like, you never say that. But if the, if he was overweight and my dude, I'm like, man, you fat ass. You know what I'm saying? Like, mm. that's the way do- women aren't like that with each other. You don't have that brutal honesty. And, and, and it's just play. Like, this is my dude. Like, I'm, I'm secretly, I'm just and trying to motivate be him to be better. In that way. And yeah, I'm like, yo, 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 you fat as shit, yo. Just, mm. Yo, go to the gym. Come to the gym with me. You know what I'm saying? I say, I say, shut the fuck up as well to my friend. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> yo, you, you just talk different. Yeah, bro, I say, oh, yeah. It's direct. It's direct. But, yeah, but I think it's like this whole programming of like the way relationships should be. Like, we program us to say it's a partnership. It's not a partnership. He's better than you, and you should probably listen to him. But it's even her. She's looking at me like I'm crazy saying this. It's probably the first. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, it's okay. It's probably the first time you've heard that, but it's like mm-hmm. I, I don't think relationships work when it's a partnership. I don't think relationships work when they're your best friends. I don't think that's ideal. I think you want a man that's better than you and you can get guidance from. And I, yeah. I think it's easier when you defer to their authority. Mm. I do. I do hear what you're saying, and I don't disagree with what you're saying at all. But <sighs> but I, but you do a little bit, a, yeah, a, a, yeah, a little bit. I do. It's I right. do a little bit. It's all right. <laughs> it's just you can say it. <laughs> it's just in the sense. Don't because... worry. Don't. Just relax. Yeah. <laughs> I think it is good when you're in a relationship though, and you're like complete opposite to the other person. Mm-hmm. But then it's good if you are quite similar. But then you just have your time to yourself when yeah. you need to. Yeah. You just need that break. But if you're opposite from what your person wants, how does that make any... How's that going to work? Because opposites attract. That's they do, fact. like masculine... Yeah, but does it last? Yeah, yeah. Opposite. Yeah, no, does it no. work? No, actually, I think masculine and femininity is like opposite. Cool. So that's probably the only opposite that would work, though. But she's talking about like, just in general interest and and morals and principles and things like I, that. I think that like your morals and your values should be the same. I agree with you. But yeah, I'm like, do I need completely. to have the same? Do I want to go fishing with a guy? No, go have fun <laughs> with your boys. They don't want us there on their boys' trips anyway. Like, but that's you know, hobbies, bro. Yeah. That's that's more like. Fun and, and hobby. Yeah, and look like at like yeah. career pet, completely different. I don't. Mm. But if I'm talking mm. about like what I want out of life and what I see in the future, yeah, things like that. The if, she, if, if she wants to be in the club all the time, and I and I. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah you yeah, know yeah, what I'm yeah, saying. Yeah, yeah, I want yeah, something. Yeah. I, I it's not going to work. You can't be complete opposite. We have yeah. to be on mm. some form of mutual some understanding, and mutual yes. ground. Yeah. Yeah. Otherwise, it's not going to work. And that's the problem with most relationships. You guys have nothing in common. I think it comes down to mindset. One hundred percent. Having a uh, having a similar mindset to I someone agree. is probably what mm, you want, mm. to be honest. Because if someone's got a higher vibrational mindset than you, you're gonna you'll be drawn to yeah. That. You'll probably achieve different things. But if you're a lower vibrational, you'll you'll just get bored of that person because you'll be like, I actually can't mm. get through to you. You're not making sense of what I'm saying because they're not there. 
Mm. Do you know what I mean? They're not on that level with you. Yeah, no, the comprehension think you're a is not there. Person. I don't, think, I don't think anybody is above anyone, which is why I disagree with the whole um, your man should be better than you. I agree with the sense mm. that you should learn from your man, mm -hmm. vice versa with with you. Why why would a man want to be with a woman that he can't learn anything from? Do you know what I mean? I don't think men want to learn anything from us. Yeah, I don't think, yeah. I don't think that's like I a. Mean, I'm, a I'm, I'm yeah. don't think that's valuable. I'm sure the, like, I'm sure it's you cool. Guys don't, like if I can learn something from my woman, that's yeah, cool. I'll, I'll, tell table, a, I'll tell him a fun fact from time to <laughs> yeah. time, but you know, like no. I don't. I, I want to not. You feel important and empowered as a man when you're leading. If you're leading, if you're teaching me, that means you're in some form leading me. Now, I'm not saying that there ain't situations where I'm dedicated to a girl and she can teach me things. I, I value guys that 100%. Like it, but that's not like they don't. Up here. don't it's not the like point girls to play dumb yeah because it makes him feel like a man if he's why teaching should you. i play dumb when actually i'm an intelligent I, woman i think i think women should <laughs> play dumb a little bit and let, let him feel like a guy yeah. you know what you know, I mean? you know the best you know the best way to talk to women is so i'll tell you what the best way is go on then like, oh my baby don't worry about it squeeze the cheeks get <laughs> along with it no. like, yes bro yes god it's gonna like, oh my baby <laughs> you go like how's your day she goes like oh see but then you feel then, belittled you, when then, men no, do it's that not even that. It's cute. it is you don't find it cute what, not all the time not all the time would the time. you prefer she a guy? finds it cute if she likes him of course <laughs> that's what i'm talking about if he was one of the sex it's cute Creepy no. and attraction, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> There's a limit to it, though. Like, if that. it was all the time, then uh, it'd be like, nah, like I'm yeah. not playing with that. Taking the piss now, mate. Yeah. <laughs> it's not even that. It's just like... Half the time, they're only doing it to get what they want. Anyway. Yeah, because yeah. they want to be more empowering let's say, than you, when it should just be okay, equal. Let's say you love him, yeah? Mm. And then he loves you. Mm. He's like, oh, my baby, come here. Let me give you a hug. Let me squeeze your cheeks. You're a little kid. Yeah, that is you know lovely to have. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But not all the time. Like, we, we'd, we'd rather I'm, that, I'm we'd, okay, but we'd rather that than speak about serious subjects. Like, oh, what happened But then men there? don't you know like that, though. Say if I did that to my man, like, oh, it's all right, darling, don't worry. Some men don't <laughs> like that. Don't, and they can't lay on your chest. I've had that before of a guy.